welcome to the November edition of What's Happening Around Town for the City of San Bruno. I'm your host, Stephanie Tevis. Thank you for joining me. This month in San Bruno, we have many things to tell you about. Stay tuned as we begin. The kitchen is the heart of the home, especially around the holidays. Thanksgiving is a day when there is a flurry of activity as well as a house full of people. Thanksgiving is also the leading day for home fires involving cooking equipment. Take the following extra precautions to ensure everyone stays safe. Stay in the kitchen when cooking on the stovetop to keep an eye on things. Don't leave home while the turkey is in the oven. Be sure to check on it regularly. Keep children and animals at least three feet away from the stove. Keep the kids away from hot foods and liquids. A splash or spray from hot vegetables, coffee, or gravy could cause serious burns. Keep the kitchen floor clear of children, pets, toys, bags, or other items that could be a tripping hazard. Keep knives and other sharp objects away from children. Make sure cords from carving knives, coffee makers, hot plates, and mixers don't dangle off the counter within the reach of small children. Keep children away from lit candles or fireplaces. And make sure your smoke detectors are working properly by pushing the test button. For more Thanksgiving safety tips, go to nfpa.org. Discover the magical world of shadow puppetry with Spin Me a Shadow, Tell Me a Tale, a performance by Shadow Puppet Workshop on Monday, November 13th at 6.30 p.m. Introduce your children to the art of shadow puppetry. Held in the downstairs community room at the library, this free assembly will include versions of some best loved folk tales from around the world. Be sure to come early for a seat, because once the seats are full, the doors will be closed. Spin me a shadow, tell me a tale, the shadow puppetry performance where members of the audience become active participants and will receive shadow puppet templates to continue the fun at home. Shadow Puppetry Workshop on Monday, November 13th at 6.30 p.m. in the library's downstairs community room. Great fun for people of all ages. Attention San Bruno Library card holders! RB Digital is here! RB Digital Magazines, the world's largest newsstand, offers full-color digital magazines for anytime, anywhere reading on desktops, mobile devices, and apps. The collection of popular digital magazines includes both new and backlist titles with no holds, no checkout periods, and no limits. For more information about RB Digital, please contact the library at sppl at plsinfo.org or call 616-7078. The San Bruno Library will host a special story time on Thursday, November 16th. Join us at 11.15 a.m. for a special firefighter story time. A real live firefighter will make an appearance at the library. Come talk and read with a San Bruno firefighter on Thursday, November 16th at 11.15 a.m. If you have an immigration question or legal matter to discuss, make your free 20-minute appointment with a lawyer in the library on Wednesday, November 8th. From 6 p.m. until 8 p.m., you can discuss your issues pertaining to immigration law. Call the library to make your free 20-minute appointment today. The annual holiday tree lighting event takes place on Thursday, December 7th this year. Sing along with the St. Robert School Choir as they fill the air with popular holiday tunes. Santa will arrive just in time to turn on the tree lights. Then wait your turn to sit on Santa's lap to tell him what you wish for. Snacks and arts and crafts will be available for your enjoyment as well. Be sure to dress warmly as this event takes place rain or shine at the Veterans Memorial Building in San Bruno City Park. Join your San Bruno community at the annual holiday tree lighting event on Thursday, December 7th at 5.30 p.m. Handmade gifts are something special to give and to receive. Find truly unique items for sale at the annual Holiday Boutique on Saturday, November 25th. This year, it will be held at the Veterans Memorial Recreation Center. There is no interest fee, so you will have plenty more cash to spend on handmade gifts. The annual Holiday Boutique on the Saturday after Thanksgiving from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Can you have too much of a good thing? Let's celebrate Thanksgiving early with your friends at the Recreation Center on Friday, November 17th. 
Rick Keen will sing and play guitar starting at 10.30 a.m. And the turkey lunch with all the traditional sides will be served at noon. Share your gratitude and some lunch on Friday, November 17th at the Veterans Memorial Recreation Center. Have your blood pressure taken and blood glucose tested on Friday, November 17th at the Senior Center. Starting at 9.30 a.m., a registered nurse will take seniors on a first-come, first-served basis for these free tests. You must have fasted for 12 hours before taking the glucose test. Afterwards, stay for a presentation on what you can do to prevent diabetes at 11.15 a.m. The free blood pressure and glucose testing on Friday, November 17th at the San Bruno Senior Center starting at 9.30 a.m. Come laugh for the fun of it. Join your friends for the free laughter yoga class on Thursday, November 9th. For one hour starting at 10.30 a.m., elevate your mood simply by laughing. Studies have shown that when you smile, your mood becomes lighter and happier. So imagine what a laugh does for you. So come laugh along with us at the free laughter yoga class on Thursday, November 9th from 10.30 until 11.30 a.m. at the Senior Center. Come spend the day at the races at Golden Gate Fields on Friday, November 10th. The bus leaves from Library and Magnolia in Millbrae at 11 a.m. At noon, your unforgettable afternoon in the Turf Club begins. Enjoy a hosted buffet and a fantastic view of the track. The first race begins at 1.45 p.m. All of this for only $86 per person. For more information, contact Dorothy Carmichael at 588-8375. A day at the horse races at Golden Gate Fields in Berkeley on Friday, November 10th. Relatively speaking, the winters here in San Bruno are mild, compared to many places around the world. However, the rainy season here is damp and cold. And there are some easy and inexpensive fixes you can do around the house to prepare for the upcoming winter season. Make sure your heater is in good working order. Install new air filters every three months when the heater is being used. Reverse ceiling fans so they turn clockwise to push the hot air down. This is especially effective in rooms with high ceiling. Check the roof for damage, loose, or missing shingles that may cause a leak once it starts to rain. Check and repair breaks in the flashing seals around vent stacks and chimneys. Clean out the rain gutters. If the gutters are full of leaves or pine needles, water can back up and damage the roof, siding, or trim not to mention the possibility of causing leaks. Check for missing or damaged gutters and get them repaired or replaced. Divert water from downspouts so that the water runs at least three to four feet away from the foundation. Flexible spout extenders are inexpensive and easy to attach. Call a chimney sweep if you use your fireplace regularly during the winter months. If done once a year, this will prevent fires and also prevent carbon monoxide from creeping into the home. Install weather stripping, door sweeps, and attic insulation to keep the warm air inside during the winter months and outside in the summer. Installing an insulated water heater blanket is another cost-effective way to save money. Use window covering. It is surprising how much insulation curtains, drapes, and even mini blinds can provide. Finally, the City of San Bruno will have sandbags available for residents to safeguard your home. A sandbag station is set up in the parking lot behind Fire Station 51 on El Camino Real. Do you need to transact business with the City of San Bruno? Keep in mind that City offices, except for Fire and Police Emergency Services, will be closed on Friday, November 10th for Veterans Day. Offices will reopen on Monday, November 13th. And City offices will be closed on Thursday, November 23rd and Friday, November 24th for the Thanksgiving holiday. Offices will reopen on Monday, November 27th. Well, this wraps up the November edition of What's Happening Around Town. I'm Stephanie Tevis. Enjoy the beginning of your holiday season. Bye-bye. <laughs>